So after connecting your system uh, and powering your system, first step of course is to check your initialization. Is the antenna moving? Is it moving as it should? And from that point you can connect Aptus and start commissioning your system. Um, if we look at the system right now, we can see it's connected. Uh, in this situation, it tells me here in product information that the antenna is a V100. Give me the antenna name, and basically this name can be broken down in the parts, components, which are uh, mounted on your system. The antenna serial number, the ACU, and the ACU serial number. Uh, on a new system, the serial number should match. Although there is no relation between the two numbers uh, to make it operational. Firmware, antenna voltages. So inside the antenna, we are measuring antenna voltage and buck voltage. Both are set for 24 volts. We can see in this situation, there is no heading connected. So there is no blue dot flashing and also no indication. But the GPS is receiving information and every 10 seconds you can see that uh, it's, it's, it's turning blue, indicating that receiving satellite. Modem state or the TX state, of course the antenna is not commissioned, so it's uh, only LMB and blockage are blue, meaning there is no blockage and the LMB is not turning. So first step would normally be connect, find the serial port which you need to connect to and then press connect and it will uh, connect to the antenna. From this point you will start your commissioning and there is no real fixed order of commissioning your antenna. Uh, of course there is a recommended order. The way I always do it uh, first, I'll check my firmware. I'll make sure that the firmware inside the antenna is the latest one. All these systems are tested, um, updated with the latest firmware before leaving factory. But of course, if you have it in your warehouse for a while, it's possible that there is outdated firmware. So first step would be checking the firmware. Then the next step would be testing or checking your tilt sensor, is the water bubble on your level cage centered? If not, you should center it, but as I said, it's a check because these sensors are calibrated. The rate sensor check, uh, I will explain a little bit more about that in a later stage. The pole sensor calibration, just check. It's not a calibration, but it's a, it's a check because it's already calibrated from factory. And then from that point, you would start your first search for satellite, uh, calibrate bow offsets, and see if you can move between uh, different satellites. Then final step is your modem have to select which modem you are using and then if necessary uh, the last step would be go into the web GUI and set IP information there so you're able to communicate with your modem uh, from, from the ACU.